Hey, what up, YouTube? D4G here, banging out another video. Y'all already know what it is, man. It's Fragrance Friday. Well, today, we're going to be going over cheap, more specifically, cheapies that you can get for under $30. Let's get it. know before we get started man I'm trying to hit 200 subscribers by the end of march so what i need i need y'all to help me help y'all help me go ahead and hit that subscribe button and bell notification if you've been in for more than two videos if you see any of our football fragrance or our lifestyle vlogs we just ask that you support the channel by hitting that subscribe button as well as the bell notification that way you can be updated anytime we drop any new content but all that being said let's get into it all right so one i want to say this first and foremost most of these cheapies that i have right here you can find at a discount you can find them at ross you can find it at burlington's marshall's you can even find it online for around the same price but if you don't want to wait you can always go on the hunt and go to one of those stores and find those the first one that we're going to be going over is Hollister Wave. The first one, man. This is a woody aromatic fragrance. I want to say I bought this one from Ross for like 20 bucks, 100 ml. Good, man. It still has a little bit of synthetic opening, but this is a good fragrance to have in your collection. If you're getting started off, you're trying to figure out what you like, you want to get you a little cheapy, something to get you started with your collection, this right here is a good fragrance to have. And then in the middle towards the base, you're going to get some lavender, some cypress, some musk, some tonka beans. It's not bad man this is a good fragrance to have during the summer man. i remember my first time getting this and wearing it me and my boy ryan we was about to go get something to eat hopped in the car man before i could even close the door he asked me what was i wearing i had to tell him man because it's a good fragrance man it lasts good on me now we'll say this all of these fragrances a lot of these fragrances they're not going to be those beast mode performing fragrances you know what i'm saying they're not going to these all cheapies they're not going to be eight ten hours most of these right here about five hours on me which ain't bad because most of the time if i'm wearing this i don't mind reapplying it because i'm probably doing something throughout the day i ain't coming back home for a little while i'm just going out doing some errands i might do something at, at um like something outside that's where this right here will come in handy at man i get good see i drop for this one about an arm and a half projection as far as like my bubble that it gets because i do i have gotten some good compliments off this one so the first one is going to be hollister wave now the second one you already know i got a back door with the second one and we're talking about hollister wave too man this is an aromatic fragrance right here a little bit different than the first one a little bit different than the first one and this one you're gonna have some bergamot you got some more white pepper in there up top then when it goes down to the mid and the base you got geranium spice musk woody notes man it's not hey it's a good fragrance cheapy gold another one that you can get at like marshall's or ross thirty dollars not bad these are all great spring and summertime fragrances form better in the heat so these right here are good fragrances to have if you want to get something to go out even i wear this to a pool to be honest because dipped in the water like when we it'll still be on me somewhat you know what i'm saying still get good projection good hey good bubble off of this one man i like this one a lot now the third fragrance that we're going to be on over you know we can't leave our mouth out treasure in the week man the green Irish tweed clone you don't want to get if you like creed but you don't like the price of creed <laughs> that's where our mouth comes in at because they're good at making creed uh creed clones and i'm telling you right now it's not a synthetic good fragrance uh man this is fresh man i love this thing right here man it's an aromatic spicy fragrance you got some lemon you got some lavender you got some spicy notes in there you got some sandalwood springtime evening time when i first started in my collection this would be one that i wear if i'm going to like a a day event you know what i'm saying if i'm going out to a let's say if i'm me and we're going to we're going to a brunch or we're going to just do something to where it's a little bit outside but still indoors a little bit more intimate i'm bringing this one out right here right here I'm, this right here I don't even gotta smell it. I can smell it right now, man. That shit is good. And this is more of the this is one of the longer performing fragrances of this bunch. Now, this one I do get about six, close to seven with this one. Don't mind reapplying. Again, all these are cheapies. I don't mind reapplying these if I feel the need to do so. So let's say if I'm already out for an hour or two and we're going to another, we're going to another spot, I reapply this in the car. I have no problem with applying it. Because again, it's a cheapie. It's not 160 Savage Elixir, nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? So I do not mind reapplying some of these fragrances as the day goes on. The next one, this is probably my favorite 
favorite one out of this bunch. And that's gonna be Calvin Klein's Summer One, the 2019 edition, man. As you can see, I already knocked out a good little dent before. I got this one around August of last year. I already knocked out a good little dent on this one, man. This one right here is one of the best performing of this bunch. As far as overall, cause you get a great sillage, you get a great scent, you get a get, you get great projection. Now you don't get the longevity that you get with the trays and the wheat, I will say that. But for cheapy gold, man, look. And it doesn't have that synthetic opening as well. That's what I love about this. It's not harsh in the opening. Now this is an aromatic and aquatic fragrance. And honestly, this is a very simple bottle. Like all it has is water notes, some tea, and some driftwood in there, from what I've seen. And you can smell it. The most you smell from this is the aquatic notes. The water notes definitely take over for most of what you will get out of this right here. You're gonna smell a lot of aquatic notes. It's a good scent, especially in the heat. This is a monster in heat. Out of all these, this will probably be the most, this will be the better performing one of the I just love the way this smells, man. Again, another cheapy gold, cheapy classic, man. This stuff, you can't go wrong with this. Again, this one's $20 at Marshalls. No, you can get this one at Burlington's for 20 bucks. 2019 edition, they do have a 2020 edition as well i think but i haven't tried that one but if you want one that i'm telling you right now i wear hey this right here you can wear this to the lake you can wear this to the beach you can wear this outside you go into the pool something like that this right here is another one that i would spray on without hesitation and last but not least this one is a personal favorite man i'm not going like this is the i would like to think that this is the first bottle of cologne i've ever gotten if it wasn't the first one it's definitely top three in the first three bottles that i bought and i'm talking about one that i don't see a lot of people talk about I'm talking about Kenneth Cole reaction. This one right here, you can definitely get out of Burlington. I've seen this one at Burlington for around $20, $25, $100 a mil. If you're somebody that likes citrus, aromatic fragrances, if you like green apple, um, lemon, lime, musk, patchouli, that's what this is right here. Now, it does have a synthetic opening. Don't get it twisted. Man, once you get past that opening, that green apple comes out so much. I love this during the spring. I love this during the springtime. And this right here is, a, is for me, this is a springtime, summertime, classic, cheapy gold. Like, I'll probably always carry this around with me. This is this one that'll always stay in my collection just because of the sentiment values that it has for me, but also just because of how it wears and how I, how one, I love the way this smells on me. I don't wear fragrances for other people. I wear fragrances because I like the fragrance that I'm wearing. If I don't like it, I'm not gonna wear it. I'm not gonna buy it. This right here is one of those. It doesn't, it gets a lot of, it doesn't get talked about as much, but for me, this right here, I'm telling you that green apple, the melon in this, when it dries down, the patchouli comes out a little bit, but the green apple is still there. The green apple takes over a lot in this, and I love this fragrance right here. I'm gonna spray it one more time. I can smell it, but I won't spray it again, just like, so bro. Cheapy, man. Cheapy, classic, cheapy gold, man. This one right here, I ain't even gonna say too much. I'm just gonna go ahead and put that down. All right, y'all, so that was gonna be my five cheapies for under $30. I will have a link in the description for all those. If you want to go and order it online, you don't want to go through the hunt of trying to find it in a store or something like that. But again, if you don't want to pay that shipping, you can find almost all of these fragrances besides the trays in the week. You can find all of these fragrances at a Burlington's Ross Marshalls near you, TJ Maxx even. They all have it. You can find all these in those type of stores. So if you don't mind doing like a little hunt, you can go out and find them in those, man. And then, like I said, they'll be all up under all under $30. On average, it'll be around $20 to $25 for the 100 mil. All right, y'all, that's gonna be it, man. That's gonna be it for the day. I'm gonna get up out of here. I'm about to go get this workout in real quick. Y'all already know Vegas coming up, man. So, hey, it's about to be a good one, man. Y'all gonna see that Revitalizer Monday vlog. You is not, you do not want to miss that one, I swear. It's gonna be a straight, move with all that being said d4g truly blessed us for greatness hey we out